only thing that's um, something that's made about this season, I think. Yeah, it's brilliant. Um, it's a great boost for us. You said the, the bread and butter of the league is our priority, but um, when you get to the quarterfinals of the Cup, you're only two wins away from the final, and we reinforce that to the players um, how special it is to play in Cup finals, and they don't come around too often. So the carrot of of coming here today and, and trying to get through was was big, and and we knew when the draw came out, um, everyone probably was deflated, Cliftonville away, and and with with Cliftonville, I think they're unbeaten here all season. And they're a fantastic team on, on their home pitch, but but I knew deep down that this surface would suit us, and if we can get a good surface, and and it, it would show that um, we would have a chance, and and that and that's what played out. It's a big performance. I mean, also Reese with the two goals, and Dean Curry as well is excellent from pretty much every header. Yeah, I think collectively to a man, I think we we got every ounce out of the players today, and I think we need that, and we need that week in week out, and you, you can single out Dean Curry, who was immense. Um, Reese on transition. Um, now in the first half, Reese nearly got in between low and, and Addis two or three times, and that was the plan to try and use that use that when we turned it over and one possession to spring in that area, and and that's what played out second half. And as you said, Reese in front of goal, who was clinical today, and and he's got that he's got that honesty where he can work up, he can help his full back, he can get in. The, he's a, he's an absolute dream to work with Reese Campbell, and today he'll take all the products for for the goals and deservedly so. And in terms of team executing the game plan to perfection, yeah. you must be thrilled. Yeah, we, we walked over it and walked over it on Thursday night, and and I think in and out of possession we were spot on. Um, now Cliftonville's got that many threats. You see, if you can nullify Murr, then then maybe Ronan heal her chain, and then you've got to be aware of Gormley's movement and the threats over the pitch. So we, we couldn't switch off today for a moment, but I think we limited them to very little. Obviously, they had they had a lot of pressure in the last 10, 15 minutes because of because of the importance and the quality they have. But I think in and out of possession today, we, we got a spot on. Has the morale boost gone on to what's obviously a very important period for you because it's obviously the relegation issue. You, the results yeah. today have gone in your favour, but with that as well. Yeah, look, nothing was ever going to be won or lost today. It wasn't going to be the end of the world if we lost or or we, we were never going to win anything or get medals by getting through. But I think we're, we'll use this now as a springboard. Um, the, use the good feeling of coming here and winning to one of the best sides in the country. And and hopefully we can now take this form and, and the standards don't drop on the, in these performances and we we'll use that to push on. Is Carrick Rangers is, is equally important next Saturday as it's well? It's more important. Carrick's more important, more important to me. Um, as you said, it's a great feeling to win. But the priority next week, the three points that's up for grabs there is, is huge. And, and the players know that.